here. Yeah, like this. If you wouldn't mean the sun or not. There's a famous story about it. You know, Newton getting the idea of uh, the, how gravity would work from looking at apple falling from these trees. John Warren, who was raised in England and was part of the same universities, uh, was also a keen apple grower and had a big orchard in the Okanagan and uh, decided that it would be very uh, nice to get some, uh, let's say, some mini trees from England and then start to plant them as a symbol for triumph. And so he obviously took a lot of effort to get this tree, or one or two Sion tree here, from which these were grafted onto other trees. The developers that were putting condos didn't care too much about neutron apple tree for them. It, you know, it's in the way, that's it. <laughs> And so there was a campaign to convince the president of the UBC to intervene and save the runabout. So that's where I got involved in some of the negotiation. Have you tasted the apples? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We used to go at lunch and, uh, you know, now it's more dangerous because there's more traffic around the circle. But <laughs> We should have links like this to very important scientists. The science has to be, it's a part of the culture. For us, it's, it's even a little bit more symbolic in a sense that um, though we have some understanding of gravity at the, the level of Newton, but gravity is still something that is not really well understood. Newton was right up to a certain level, but we have to go beyond that. That's what we're still trying to do. So we, of continuing Newton's work, if you want.